check the feet. Brothers, check the uh, uh, you now you're all of you on the end. Check the uh, camera angle. Make sure you got everybody in there. So curve, curve around. Uh, yeah, we good. Yeah, we really good though. Yeah, we got it. All right, come, come. All right, Shalom. Shalom. First and foremost, as always, we're giving all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Yahweh Shai, Yahweh Kapadash. Yahweh is the true name of our heavenly Father. Yahweh Shai is the name of His only begotten Son, now Lord and Savior, whom the world ignores, Jesus Christ. Basham Makakodash is in the name of the Holy Spirit. Right, double honors to our teachers, the apostles, and those of great millstone. Peace and salutations to the hopeful elect, faithful and diligently preaching his word with fear and trembling. Shalom to the believers that subscribe and listen through the spirit of power, Yahweh Bashim, Yahweh Shah. Right, with the GMS Memphis Camp coming at you with a live lesson tonight. All right, just touching on miracles as our Lord and Savior, Yahweh Shah, performed through the power of our Heavenly Father. Right? <clears throat> And those miracles that he performed are a testimony unto us that he is the son of the Most High. All right? Now, of course, you know, those things that were written, all right, are only half, probably not even half, Salaki, are not even half of the things that he's done. But even in our time today, all right, the Lord is showing us things. The Lord is revealing great power unto us, all right? First and foremost, the ability to even have this knowledge, this truth is a miracle, man. All right, you gotta cherish that, all right? But you seem to have these guys out here who spend more of their time diligently trying to disapprove the things written in the Bible than the time they spend, uh, you know, uh, believing, all right, and preaching the ministry of the things that was, was, was written in the Bible, man, okay? But nevertheless, uh, you know, it was set up for them to be in that lot and not to believe and not to have faith because it all boils down to faith at the end of the day, right? That's the gift that gives you the ability to, uh, you know, see these things, okay? So we're gonna get uh, what I call for first Luke, Luke 10 and 22. This is Luke chapter 10, verse 22. And all things are delivered to me of my father and no man knoweth who the son is but the father and who the father is but the son and he to whom the son will reveal him and he turned him unto his disciples and said privately blessed are the eyes which see the things that ye see right blessed are the eyes that see the things that ye see all right <clears throat> because the disciples you know they had uh, front row seats all right <clears throat> to the miracles that Yahweh Shah was performing all right, and even in the midst of those miracles he was he was performing, you had those wicked scribes and wicked Pharisees. You had unbeliever unbelievers. All right, that didn't believe he was the son of the Most High. You had those that witnessed those things just like the disciples did, yet they didn't believe. Go ahead. For I tell you, and have not heard him. Your battery low up. Yeah. You got a cord. I got my cord. I got no pay. Yeah. <clears throat> Go ahead. Read it back from the top of 24. This is Luke 10, verse 24. For I tell you that many prophets and kings have desired to see those things which ye see and have not seen them, and to hear those things which ye hear and have not heard them. Right. Okay, so why were they unable to hear those things? Give me uh give me a uh, Hebrews eleven. Quran. Hebrews eleven and one. Now faith is the substance of things hopeful and the evidence of things not seen. Right, so they didn't have that substance. You know, the <laughs> substance that it takes to see the miracles and the miraculous and marvelous works 
that the Heavenly Father is doing through his son and through the prophets, all right, and the men of the Lord, is uh, it takes faith, right? That's what it all boils down to at the end of the day. And that's why we don't spend a lot of time trying to convince uh, unbelievers, all right? Go ahead and jump down to six. <laughs> this is all y'all, give me a uh, uh, second edge. This is Hebrews 11 and 6, but without faith it is impossible to please him. For he that cometh to Yahweh Shemaoshah must believe that he is, and that he is a reward of them that diligently seek him. And that's the problem. These men that don't believe is because they don't have faith, and when they don't have faith, they don't uh, diligently seek after Yahweh Shemaoshah, right? Because they don't really believe that he's real. Okay. All right? <clears throat> Anybody that takes the time to say that anything rather than the contents of the scriptures didn't happen, all right? They, it's all because they don't believe. Or they say uh, one of the men or the disciples that Yahweh Shah set up in the ministry, words don't matter. Or the book of Hebrews, all right? We don't know who wrote it. Or, you know, anything that's written in the scriptures that's written that they don't believe is because they don't have faith, man. Yeah. All right? Because you cannot just take this Bible and choose and pick what you uh, uh, believe is real and, and what isn't, all right? You have to believe uh, that Yahweh Shai, as he says, comes in the volume of the book, okay? <clears throat> but if you don't, that's okay, because there's a reward for you as well. Give me that second Ezra 15. <clears throat> You can't set that. Uh, you can't set that in that little, little, in the group, uh, that little groove right there, brother. Show him, huh? <laughs> no big guy know how to do it. <laughs> yeah. Fifteen and three. This is uh second Ezra, chapter fifteen and verse three. Fear not the imaginations against thee. Let not the incredulity of them trouble thee that speak against thee. Go ahead. For all the unfaithful shall die in their unfaithfulness. All the unfaithful shall die in their unfaithfulness. So that's your reward. Okay. And ultimately, Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shai, that's the uh, lot that he has set for you. Okay. According to, uh, matter of fact, this is Daniel 12 and 10 or not. All right. Read that again. This is 2nd Ezra chapter 15 and verse 4. For all the unfaithful shall die in their unfaithfulness. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. Verse 5. Behold, saith the Lord, I will bring plagues upon the world, the sword, famine, death, and destruction. Right. So that's the portion of the Lord's cup that you will receive if you are unbelieving. Right. And he's going to even do that in a miraculous fashion. All right, you know this uh, this uh, virus that hit <laughs> swept throughout the country, even though it was a pandemic. You know, it was still was it still was a miraculous act. You know, but you had Jake that believe in that. Wear the mask. Mm -hmm. You know, go get go get the stick in them. Mm -hmm. You look at the things that, that Jake believe in. Theory. Yeah, the Big Bang Theory, Darwinism. We evolved from uh, monkeys. You know, all sorts of madness. <laughs> Heaven and hell. Heaven right. and hell. You know, that 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 Greek mythology doctrine, Zeus and Hades yeah, virgin, and birth. virgin birth. You know, the list goes on to the madness that our people subscribe to because they are drunk off Babylon juice, man. Yeah. And if this is the time now where the Lord is about to really show his power. So it you know, it's it's not uh, a coincidence, all right? It, it, it's not uh, a thing of, you know, something for us that's far-fetched or bizarre when people start to, start to turn away in their faith, okay? Because when things get, when things start to really get down to the nitty-gritty, that's when you're going to see who the Lord's real chosen, those that he has embedded faith in. Go ahead, Aina. It's Daniel 12 and 9, and he said, go that way, Daniel. For the words are closed up and sealed to the time of the end. Many should be purified and made white. It says many, not all. It says many shall be purified and made white. Purified 
what uh, how through the washing of the word receiving this understanding purifies your mind and shows you uh the realm of spiritual things that go on okay because remember the scriptures tell us when you go in the book of ephesians the sixth chapter that we wrestle not against flesh and blood and see that's the thing with people that don't have faith in this doctrine is because they have more faith in the things of the flesh than they do with things of the spirit go ahead they say many should be purified and made white and tried but the wicked should do wickedly and none of the wicked should understand none of the wicked shall understand man right does said the bible does said the most high all right somebody got something he said, but the wise shall understand. But the wise shall understand, right? Not the wise of this world, right? But those that are of the election, right? Romans 11 and 7. This Romans 10 and 17. So then faith coming by hearing. Oh, shall you start at 16? Come. Romans 10 and 16. But they have not all obeyed the gospel. For Isaiah said, Lord... Who have believed our report? Right, who have believed our report, man? Mm. <laughs> Go ahead. So then faith coming coming by hearing, mm. and hearing by the word of God. Right. So that's only uh that's something that's uh privileged, right? When he read in the book of Luke, it said Yahweh Shah uh privately. Right? He probably uh, uh, said to the disciples, blessed are those that see the things that you have seen. Go ahead. But I say, have they not heard? Yes, verily. They sound went out, like, they sound went into all the earth and they was unto the ends of the word. Right, which is, which is, which is prophecy. All right? As the scriptures say, uh, matter of fact, give me that uh, wisdom of Solomon 7 and 24, right? Read that again, I not. Well, from the top, just that, that, that last verse. Uh, Romans 10 and 18. But I say, have they not heard? Yes, verily they sound went into all the earth, and they words unto the ends of the word. Man, is that not a miracle? Have well, you seen Apostle Taha in Bolivia? When you seen Apostle Tahar and uh, Apostle Gabar, Apostle Makar, Apostle Rumla in Australia, in Germany, yet great millstone ministry is being preached, all right? All these different languages. You got brothers preaching uh, the word uh, with sign language, man. <laughs> Are you out of your mind to say that Yahweh Shah didn't perform miracles in his time and he's still performing miracles in this very day that we living in now? Come on, man. When you go to these, uh, you know, these Protestant churches, they go on their damn mission trips, all right? They go all over the world, and then they feed people, you know? They, they take money, and that's how they, uh, you know, win their so-called souls over. But the word is doing everything here, man. Yeah, they hate it, bro. You know that's what that is. The light's been on every time. Now tonight, they ain't coming on no more. <laughs> but the light's still on, though. Right. You see? Yeah, we, we, the light's still on, man. We got, we got the, we got the room in the room, man. Give me that wisdom of Solomon 7 and 24. This is wisdom of Solomon 7 and 24. It says, for wisdom is more moving than any motion. She passes and goeth through all things by reason of her pureness. By reason of her pureness. Hold on. What did Daniel 12 and, 12 and 10 say? Many shall be purified and made white. All right? The scriptures tell us if a brother can hold it, you know your Allah. It says, uh, therefore can no defiled thing fall into her. Go ahead. It says, verse 25, wisdom of Solomon 7 and 25. It says, for she is the breath of the power of the Most High. Right, which proves, all right, if you can receive it, that Apostle Taha, whose name is pure, all right, has the breath of Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shah, as his ministry has reached with no gimmicks, all right, no advertising, no merchandising, all right, just simply through preaching the word. That's it. All right, the pure, 
unadulterated. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Word of the most high is reached throughout the uh, four corners of the earth, man. You got it, bro. It says, and a pure influence flowing from the glory of the Almighty. A pure influence flowing from the glory of the Almighty. Go ahead. Therefore, can no undefiled thing fall into her. Right, he was already there. That's the spirit. Yeah. Can no defiled <laughs> thing fall into her, man. Okay? So it, that's why they can't receive, all right? Because their, their minds and their consciousness has been, uh, 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 what's the word? Condemned, you know? For, for lack of better words, but it's the scriptures that tell you too, brother, grab that, uh, ever, ever learning, but never able to come to the understanding of the truth. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yep. 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 Yeah, that's right, yeah. I got a song too. Uh, go ahead, brother. This is Sirach chapter one, verse 14. The fear, to fear the Lord is the beginning of wisdom, yeah. and it was created with the faithful in the womb. In the womb. All right, so you, like, like uh, Nabal, your favorite scripture, Jeremiah 1. Oh, yes, right. You know, what he told Jeremiah? From the belly, from the belly from, from, I born. Right. When I knew thee. Yep, you know, before I, I formed thee in the womb. Yeah. Before I formed thee in the womb, I knew thee and ordained thee a prophet. All right, and sanctified thee, man. Yep. Is it more? Nah, that was it. Remember, because like I said, when I, I got uh, nah, Ephesians, I got, it, I guess. So, I got right. Ephesians 2 and 8. Oh it's yeah, it's beautiful about it's, how it, it's, it's a gift. You know, faith is a gift, man, because faith comes with the ability of uh, suffering. You know, you gotta have faith. You gotta believe. You know, and that's the main objective because it said by works and by faith. All right, so you be delivered. So we gotta do our. This is Sarah one and fifteen. She had built the everlasting foundation with men, and she shall continue with their seed to the fear of the Lord is fullness of wisdom and fill of men with her fruits. Yep. <laughs> All right. And, and, and the fruits are things that you will see physically manifest. <laughs> hey, hey. All right. Yeah, we put it right down just based on the street. That's good. Yeah, keep going. Come on. That's cool. Yeah, we're just going to bag it up right here, man. Huh? Uh-uh. I just didn't bring it because DJ's always on. You know, they always on. Huh? I don't know why they ain't on tonight. You know why they ain't on. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right. I brought it just twice. I'll take the lights on. Uh, my light. Yep, you know why they ain't on. Yeah, it's good. They, cause they hate the, they hate the real life. Yeah. Yup, yup. Bring that out again. Who's reading uh, Ukara? This Sirach one and fifteen. She had built an everlasting foundation with men, and she shall continue with their seed. So fear the Lord is the fullness of wisdom and fill of men with her fruits. Right. You got it uh, on the bottom. All right. It said fill a, fill a man what? With the, the fruits, fruits, which is what? The wisdom, knowledge, and understanding. All right. And I was along with what? Faith, man. You know, uh, going back until wisdom tried you. <laughs> All right. What did that rock? All right. Go ahead, uh. I didn't say that, man. Go ahead, I now. Because this is the book of Titus. 1 and 15. Unto the pure, all things are pure. But unto them that are defiled and unbelieving, is nothing pure. Right, right, but to them that are defiled and unbelieving, is nothing pure. You got it, all. Huh? Yeah, now I'm just going to uh, read it again, because this is going to my sheep shall hear my voice. Yep. Yep. You know, because it, it's, it's a, it's a uh, clear sign, all right, when you hear certain things, it, 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 it clicks something in your, in your mind. Oh, yeah. What is add up? You know? But go ahead and read it again. Back in Titus 1 and 15, it's the top. Unto the pure, all things are pure. Right, because what is pure? The understanding, the wisdom. Alright, that's what's pure, man. This word. Go ahead. 
But unto them that are defiled and unbelieving, it's nothing pure. It's nothing pure, why? Because they don't have the understanding. Remember, the, the scripture speaks about, all right, uh, it's given unto the, to, to, to the elect, all right? It's a mystery, man. It's not given unto everybody to have the understanding. You know, it's only given to those that were chosen. Remember, from the foundation of what? Of the earth. Go ahead, out. But even their mind and conscience is defiled. Con. They. Mm -hmm. <coughs> Con. See, it say their mind and their conscience is, is defiled. So what we just read in, in uh, Wisdom of Solomon 7 chapter, right. they can't get it. All right? Because ultimately, their minds have been defiled with the uh, philosophies of Babylon. Jeremiah right? 9 and 6. Say, uh, uh, yeah, yeah, in the habitation of the sea, they were pretty trying to the Lord. Yep. You know? Yep. It's, they, they are drunk but not with wine. Yep. You know? They, they just show you this Babylon. Yeah, you got to but they just show you this Babylon, man. They drunk it, but not with wine, man. Yep. They say they profess, they profess that they know the Most High. But in works, they deny him. They do what? They, de they deny him. They deny the Lord, man. See, remember, this is this is the valley of the shadow of death. Remember, this is uh, uh, the Lord was what crucified, man. All right, he was axed out. All right, he was axed out on this side, man. Go ahead, up. Being abominable and disobedient. Being what? Being uh, abominable. Put that word out. And disobedient. Yeah. And disobedience. And unto every good work reprobate. Mm -hmm. We got a lot of that going on, all right? A lot of that going on, man. The other Israelite cast may have been rubber base. All right, but we gonna stick, we gonna stick, all right, to how the apostles stuck to it, man. All right, which is what? To teach this word in truth and sincerity, man. All right, go out there and, 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 and warn our people to repent for the kingdom of heaven is at hand. Now, that's using wisdom, man. Because you know what was coming after the, the Lord Move his prophets on the highways and the hedges. Discretion. All right, that's what's coming, man. We got it out. This abominable in the etymology, mid fourteenth century, in in enticing disgust or loathing, morally detestable. Detestable. It's a off, away from. It's a awful, dreadful, painful, painful terrible, terrible, unspeakable. Right. And then it's a exceptionally bad or displeasing. Go ahead. Which was up to the Lord. Remember, they were disobedience, man. All right. Well, they weren't keeping the laws, the commandments, <laughs> the Lord have gave them to their forefathers. They turned away from that, man. All right. They started worshiping idols. See, started taking on the custom of the heathen. Then what he punished them, man. What is he punished us? Because we get this day in our captivity, man. That was us, man. Now we have returned back to the heavenly father, man, through the spirit and the blood of our Lord and Savior Yahweh. You gotta go out. This is uh Second Timothy chapter 3 and verse 7. It reads, ever learning and never able to come to the knowledge. Turn up a verse. All right, this is uh, 2 Timothy 3 and 6. For, for of this sort are they which crept into houses and led captive silly women led with sin, led away with diverse lusts. Yeah, led, led away with diverse lusts, right? Because you got to understand, your flesh only wants to lust after things that comfort it, all right? And when you live after the flesh, you are in enmity with the most high, right? Because in the flesh you can't please the most high man right and you see more and more of these different these different groups you know they claim to be yasarala they they show themselves to be more fleshly constantly you know dealing with things like parties during the time of the passover right going into uh you know different doctrines they completely uh, uh and totally off all right, according to what's written, you know, John the Baptist wasn't in the truth. You know, like, what? When Yahweh Shah spoke very highly of, of, of John the Baptist, man. Okay? That was a miraculous work. 
he he told he spoke with John the Baptist said he uh he said uh uh there's no uh born of born of a, of a woman man all right all right so you have to that, that scriptures tell you to beware of these people all right they come with these doctrines all right they cause division because ultimately what they're doing is sowing discourse in the in the nation of israel all right but the elect won't be deceived by the discourse that they're sowing man all right the Lord has a purpose for them too, you know. And ultimately, it's going to lead to them uh, receiving a gruesome death, you know, great misery. But it's for those that He don't want, so they will have, and they have a greater followers, you know. You look at these guys like one body, I U I C, Sakari. You, you on their pages, they got thirty thousand, forty thousand subscribers, you know, just total madness. Because it's of the world. Because it's of the world. Ain't nothing but a Christianity uh, mixed in with hell. We know what I'm saying? With you, that's all it is. And, 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 and uh, black culture. Yeah. Yep. Talking about uh, Bruja. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> Doing Israelite uh, dance, you know, routines. Yeah. Then I noticed, too, they, they, they got like this, this big ass uh, production, Tyler Perry type intros and, and all that into the uh, uh, videos and stuff, man. They, they, they ain't got no videos like this on their page, man. Yeah, just straight drop. <laughs> Great Mills don't give you straight drop. For you, the, the, the most uh, introduction you're going to get is a, a, a schedule. Uh, it's gonna be brothers have a you know the schedule uh, live let you know going live at this time with a thumbnail. Right. That's all you're gonna get, man. A background. You know, brother salute, holding the Bible up. You know, that's it. You ain't finna see no air, no purple and gold airplane. Big lion coming through. You ain't finna see all that madness, man. See, that's the that's the thing that that's uh called uh, sensationalism. Yeah. You know, trying to sensationalize the truth. But then when you go into the things that's in the scriptures that that like Yahweh Shah walked on water. Moses parted the Red Sea. Oh, no, 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 it didn't happen. The Lord turned the water. No, no, it didn't happen. No, he didn't do that. You just gotta, you just gotta keep it simple. You know, stick, stick, stick to the basic. That's you what Yahweh Shai did. Is it? Keep it simple. That's what Yahweh Shai did. That's what the, that's what the apostles did. Yeah, Jake Ashton, man. Go ahead, bro. Uh, I got something. Uh, verse seven. Come, come. Verse more. seven. Ever learning, never able to come to the truth, knowledge of the truth. Yeah, ever learning, but never able to come to the knowledge of the truth, man. All right? <laughs> so it's going to be many uh, that fall into that fold. All right? So I, I, I was saying, I was telling my little cousin this today. Said, Don't wait too late, man. Hey, you ever bring out that Ephesians 2 and 8 in the bar? I don't think you brought it out. Nah, before. nah. Come, come, you got it. Nah, I don't think you brought it out. Right, this is Ephesians 2 and 8. It says, for by grace are you saved Right, grace, faith. The, grace, grace, man. And that's what, what you, you know, uh, a lot of you are not taking advantage of, mm. you know. You're not using it to your advantage, right? Because <clears throat> this... Like I say, this is an influence flowing from the Almighty. That's what grace is. Man. Divine influence of the mind. Right? And you're not taking that. Ultimately, you can't receive it if you don't have faith. You know, you can only get you can only get the divine influence if the Lord has imparted uh you faith, man. Giving you the gift of faith. <laughs> okay? But uh go ahead. 
And it says, For by grace are you saved through faith, and then not of yourselves. It is the gift of the Most High. It's the gift of the Most High, man. All right? <laughs> so, like, you know, we say the water your heart by Shimmy how was shot, man. Call her Lord, you know, your heart by Shimmy how was shot. And like my beloved brother Yakana here say, all right, better my chances. Fuck them. You know? I mean, at the end of the day, what can you do? What can you do, man? You know? I know, you know, we do have loved ones that we want to get it. All right? We, we, everybody, all of us, they'll be saved through us. Lord willing, that's the only way they're going to make it. You know? Hey, because hey, uh, this Second Corinthians uh, 5 and 7, but we walk by faith, not by sight. Yep. You know, we're telling them they ain't harking, but when, <laughs> when, when the truth was presented to us, what we do? We harking. You know, so we got to continue to walk by faith, man. Well, you say faith, like the brother read in Romans, faith coming by hearing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Niggas just walk right by, like, blood died like he's hell. Yeah, blood. <laughs> you know? <coughs> Cause, 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 like I say, is it, going back to eat. Something you heard, then you, when you think about it, you started with digestion. All right, that's why this word is similar to uh, to food, man. But you gotta know how. Hey, Mike, kind of turn in like me, and yeah, y'all slide it. Let the brother uh, come up some, come up some karate, nah, karate, yeah. come back. Just kind of turn a little bit. Like I try to get that like way out. Yeah, make yeah. I think it's three man. Yeah. <laughs> nah, I'm just, we don't got to, we just need to, like, box in. Yeah, like, like box right in. Now. Like, y'all see the elders in Dallas, box in. Yeah, yeah, there you go. Let's see. <laughs> Get the win now. You ready, bro? Go ahead, bro. This is Isaiah 44 <clears throat> and verse 18. It says, they have not known nor understood. Yep. For he have shut their eyes mm -hmm. that they cannot see. And their hearts that they cannot understand. All right. Hey, was that the prayer that King David prayed? You know, brother can grab that. <laughs> read that again from the top. Uh, reading it, call y'all can know. This is Isaiah 44 and 18. They have not known nor understood. For he have shut their eyes that they cannot see. And their, their hearts that they cannot understand. What can we do about that? You can't fight against the most high. <laughs> you know? Hey, I want to get it in the NLT. You got it. <laughs> it says, uh, Isaiah 44 and 18 in the NLT. Such stupidity and ignorance, their eyes are closed. Yep. What the Lord say, my people are destroyed <laughs> for lack of knowledge. Because yep. they have rejected knowledge. All right? <laughs> Cause this is a bunch, this it's a buffet of this truth. Like this, this word is being foolproof daily. You know, me and the brother Yash was talking about that last night, man. You, you be like, man, you see how much stuff brothers be bringing out. You be like, man, where you find that at? Right. You know what I'm saying? Uh, hey, hey, what's that? Uh, what's that? Uh, hey, man, where'd you find that little uh, uh, DJ? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> where'd you, where'd you find, find this? Yeah. Hey, yeah. 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 right, the brother be using that. Uh, you know the uh, elder brother out there in uh, LA, GMS, get this work. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Go ahead, bro. It says, um, and they cannot see, their minds are shut, and they cannot think. Their minds are shut. Mm. You know? Mm. What can you, so if, you, if your mind is shut, how you gonna receive divine influence of the mind? The Lord didn't, because you gotta understand, we, we, we're getting this uh, word, this truth from another dimension. So your mind, like Jake walking around completely oblivious to the spiritual right, realm. Right. <laughs> yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, yeah. How we, like how we we spot out this, this situation, right, standing under this pavilion, how right. all this time the light, the light's on behind us. Yeah. Right. Right. Like, yeah. so the light's time to come on. So why are they not on here now? Right. Spiritual warfare. 
You know, they got, we know they got cameras. They can see, you I know. know. Who are these guys? You hear what they saying? Hey, make sure you turn the lights off next time they call. <laughs> you know? But you can't stop this truth. As the scriptures say, you can do nothing against the truth, but for the truth. Right. That's everything you do against the truth is already prophesied for you to do. <laughs> That's the power of it, man. Exactly. <laughs> the Lord got everybody number. <laughs> Y'all got it. This is Romans 11, verse 8. According as it is written, the Most High has given them the slot. 11 and 7. Start at 7. Oh, I was good. Come. This is Romans chapter 11, verse 7. What then? Israel has not obtained that which it seeking for, but the election obtained it. And the rest were blind. Yeah, because Jake, you know, always talking about keep it real and how 100 he is, <laughs> you know. But when it comes to receiving the real truth of life and what our purpose is and who we are as a people and the, and the true names of our power, right. you know, oh, that, that ain't real, man. That, yeah, man no, that's no, white no, man no, wrote no, that. No, you know, it's a hundred excuses of why this ain't real, you know. Yeah. But you will tell Jake about Hollywood and the witchcraft that goes on, and you speak about the Illuminati, they, they believe, yeah. you know, they, they, and, and this shit is just in plain sight. Like, nigga, don't you see? Nigga, don't you know the boogeyman in the closet? I mean, the closet open now, just walk in your closet, so he really not hiding. <laughs> nigga standing there breathing hard. <laughs> right here, you like, damn, nigga, you, he telling you he the devil. He's showing you, like, like he say, uh, Revelation 12 and 12, the devil has come down to you have a great rap because he knows that he had for a short time. Now, you name a raffle, a raffle man that's secretive. Right. A raffle man, not, he not, he not, you know, he, he's past that deception part. Yeah, he up front person. He up, he up, he live and direct with it now, man. <laughs> Putting it in the movies, you know putting it in the media, yep. you know? It was a time where you had to go to alternative media to even catch any truth. Right. Now it's shit is in mainstream media, man. Yeah. You know? Well, you know, it's, it, it's, it's mostly still an alternative news, but shit, you, you, can turn on the, you can turn on Fox 13, local news, goddammit, and see prophecy. You can turn on your local news station. That's right. Come on, man. So you what? know this is the time. Yup. Yup. Go ahead. You want this song 96? I mean 69. Yup. What you doing with that? Yeah, yup, yup, yup. You got some more on there, though. Right. I, thought, I thought it was a new. It probably is. It's probably it's saying the same, the same thing. thing. Okay. Yeah, yeah, because the men said the same thing, man. Mm. You know, Apostle Paul, he, he he was in them scriptures, man. The old testament. That's what that's everybody you dudes be talking about uh old testament only. <laughs> what you talking about? You got a favorite quote. <laughs> Pastor Paul have a favorite quote. Come as on, man. Jacob the have I love and Esau thing. have I hated. You see? That now Old Testament only can, can tell you that Esau is uh uh uh, uh the so-called white man and that the Lord hated Esau. Yeah. But then I guess when Apostle Paul said, oh no. That ain't, that ain't, uh-uh. Right. You know, like, the men are saying the same thing, man. All the prophets pretty much, uh, the men of the Lord, they spoke the same thing, all right? Different perspectives, but they, you know, they, the narrative is still the same. The narrative is still the same, man. Just like you see, just like you see uh, today, same thing. Same thing. You see these different uh, GMS caps, all right? All over, guess what? We speaking the same thing. Why? Because it's one body. Yep, breaking it down to you in real time right. as it was prophesied to happen in our time. Right, because we speak of the word the same <laughs> thing with it is Jeremiah 28, prophets are old. Yep. All right. What well, we speak of what? War, even pestilence, man. Yep. See, but it's just a uh, a greater time than we in now, man, because we at the end. Even though uh, the apostles see this uh wanted to see this day, man. All right. Well guess what? We here. We just waiting. We just waiting on the Lord to uh, 
you know, get a load of green light, man. Hey, we waiting on, uh, matter of fact, get that, uh, be as, as pilgrims on earth. That, that's all we we just we waiting on we waiting on more miracles we waiting on things right. greater it said it said the next because we just went into that the, the next exodus right uh is is going uh far exceed the last exodus it said it shall no, no longer be said that uh the lord lived delivered us out of the land of egypt but the yeah, lord lived us that, that, that delivered us out of the land of the north country man right. so he if he parted the red sea then what what Great work do you think he's going to do in this time? Right, Far greater, more power. Right, when he part the earth. When he said, I'm not, I'm coming, I'm not going to meet the, we're going to see Yahweh Shai in a form like, uh, you know, uh, uh, what's his name? Oh, uh, Dragon Ball Z, uh, God damn it. Freeza. Yeah, Freeza. And, right, and, 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 and the final form, yeah. golden. Yeah. golden. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. We're going to see him in a, in, 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 in that, full embodiment of god power man you know we waiting to see that man go ahead uh uh, uh, uh this is second answer chapter 16 and verse 40. oh my people hear my word make you ready to die battle and in those evils be even as pilgrims upon the earth Yep, and you get that word pilgrims, because that's where that's what pilgrims uh go into uh just get it. Seeking a miracle. It, seeking a miracle. And then look up the word miracle in the etymology. And they why they doing that, brothers, if you ain't got nothing, give me half a cool one. You got something? Go ahead, bring it out. This pilgrim in the etymology, late 13th century, is a religious obligation seeking some miracle or spiritual benefit. Yeah. Seeking some miracle or spiritual benefit. Right. And what benefit is it for you calling yourself one body in your house shy, then preach that your house shy didn't do miracles? Right. Like you a fucking moron, man. Yeah. Why don't you niggas go jump off a cliff or something, man? Hey, cause one thing about it, <clears throat> you're gonna need a miracle to make it out of there, to make it out of her. You're gonna need a miracle, man. Alright, when 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 times get bad, man. That's when the famine comes. All right, like he said, he's gonna spike Egypt as before, but it's gonna be what even worse at this time. Cause gonna be see the scripture speaks about how it's gonna be a time like never before, or never will be for generation. Hit from on out, man. Hey, the brother just posted uh, Salak, y'all. You got it. The brother just posted. Brothers been posting. Blood rain falling in, out the sky in Ukraine. Mm. In real time. Oh, is it UK or Ukraine? UK. UK, Salaki. In the UK. Right after the, like, matter of fact, it was on the Passover. On the Passover. Uh, you know, we see that. We say, call her like, like, how about she be how shot? Y'all niggas see that, uh, there was something in the air. It probably was chemtrails. Right. Right. They believe Esau's signs. <laughs> they believe in Esau. They believe, they believe in the wicked's power more than they believe in the power of the righteous, man. Right. You know? You know Esau got some type of uh he'll try to make he'll try to make up a reason to say that ain't that ain't what we see. We we looking at the blood, right? Esau tell you it's you know yeah, it's but actually it's yeah. you know, molecular <laughs> we see what this is, man. Goddamn devil. See the moisture and the condensation in the air, right. and uh, you know all of that together. The that's mountains in look. in in. Get the fuck out of here, man. Anyway, when you get through, is when you get through, everything belongs to the Most High, and the Most High He revealed it to whom, uh, who He revealed these miracles to whom. Uh, is other household of faith to receive it, man. You know? <laughs> this is a whack. Go ahead, brother. Bring it out. This is a whack, 36 and 5. And let them know thee, as we have known thee, that there is no power but only thou, oh, you have much much shot. There is no power. All right, so even like, you know, when you go to Romans 13, that's a, that's a precept to that scripture. Yeah. It say, it say the powers that be are ordained of the most high. And there is no power but of the most high. Yeah. You know? <laughs> so at the end of the day, when you see these these uh witches and warlocks on the left hand side, they do these different uh 
so-called miracles because you had egypt had uh uh fucking magicians man all right <laughs> but it got to a point it got to a point to where they were like we can't do that right. like like moses and aaron was coming in the name of your heart by i was shot performing miracles them niggas like uh, it's not working we can't right. <laughs> you, you know what i'm saying because right. the lord will get these uh these uh demons uh power to do certain things all right ultimately so you can be enchanted by it they show show new signs and make other strange wonders, which is a miracle. They say, glorify thy hand and thy right arm, that they may set forth that wondrous works. Right, meaning Yahweh Shai. That's who you're supposed to be glorifying. Right, because those wondrous works, really, because like I said, in the army of the Most High, all right, Yahweh Shai is the general. He, he, he's the one that gets the orders from the Most High. It carries these things out, man. Also, too, bro, uh, <laughs> us receiving the truth. Yeah, that, that, that was a, a miracle in itself. Huh? That's yeah, a wonderful yeah, work yeah. the Lord have done, man. Yeah. All right, giving us this knowledge of wisdom and this understanding. All right, because look, when you see where you uh, where you come from, woo, you know what I'm saying, the type of mindset you done had, you, you, you know that was a, the, the Lord, man. It's a miracle, man. Because you, you once didn't have this type of mind state once before. Jake was really dead, you know what I'm talking about? Yep. The Lord had woken us up, man. That's a miracle. Yep. All right, at the right time when Babylon finna be destroyed. Yep. You can't tell me that a miracle, man. Yep. And this and this prophecy, like like this written in the scriptures that we was gonna be awakened in the in the last days. Right. Yep. And now, now it's happening right before your very eyes. And niggas don't believe. And you still can't see it. That's, that's how you know the power you have by Shema Shai too, because you still got people walking around here that can't see it. Yeah, exactly. And it's all written, it's all prophesied, it's all, you know. Yeah. The Lord got everybody in their lot, man, doing doing exactly what they supposed to do. Right, like the scriptures say, like in the days of Noah. And he got, us, he got us here just watching it all play out. Yep. You know, like, <clears throat> you know, we, we in the movie, but we already know what's going to happen. We watching everybody else in the movie. They don't know what the fuck going on. It's funny, really. Like you really look at Jake and Jake be out it, like they be pointing, they be laughing at us like we the joke. Now, nah, nigga, you the joke. Right, right. <laughs> Jokes on day. you. At the end of the day, the joke's gonna be on you, man. That's right. That's you right. know. Yeah. Y'all both got it. This is Psalms 110, verse three. Thy people shall be willing in the day of thy power yes, in the beauties of holiness from the womb of the morning. Thou hast the dew of thy youth. Yep. They're going to be willing when, when, the, when the most high <laughs> give, us that in, give, us that in, give us that increase, man. Yep. That's right. Lord, Lord willing, because it's going to be times where brothers going to be doing miraculous things right. on, on the earth. Give me that Habakkuk 1. <laughs> You got it, uh, uh, the mom. Great work should you do? Yeah, let's get that too. This is Habakkuk chapter 1, verse 5. Behold, ye among the heathens. Huh? This is Habakkuk chapter 1, verse 5. Behold, ye among the heathens, in regard and wonders marvelously. For I will work a work in your days, which ye would not believe. Don't it be told you. All right. He said he gonna work a work in our day, all right, which people are not gonna believe, though it be told unto them. Right. <laughs> like, oh, yeah, you know, those uh, flying things you see in the air hooping around, they call UFOs. Those the chariots of the most high. You know that, right? Like, like you know, you have you know that time we were somewhere and we was looking, they was like, what y'all looking at? Oh, we was at uh I can't remember where uh, we was at. Uh, <laughs> at the Mexican, Mexican spot. spot yeah. <laughs> what, what is that? <laughs> yeah. You know? That's an airplane. Just, 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 no <laughs> just wait till you see us. Matter of fact, get there. They should mount up like eagle. Just just, just wait till you I'll see us. <laughs> Jake Seaver. Yeah, I, I feel Jake, like I can do it right now. Jake Seaver. <laughs> I don't believe, man. Hey, Jake Seaver still don't want to believe. Yeah. You know, when I was um, you know, visiting my pops out there in Dallas, you know, my little family, I, I seen a chariot. I said, you see that? He's like, yeah, I see it. 
I said, what that is? Man, Paul is sad, like, I said, get the fuck out of here, man. When have you ever seen a sad, like, you know, move, you know? Right. Only sad, like, nigga that seen is direct TV on their house. <laughs> right. Yeah, I'm out of sad, like. No All the shit like they see in a movie. That's why they're going to be amazed at the screening of our salvation. Man, beautiful. They're going to be amazed, man. You know, hey, they always was amazed. Had a had a Lord always made an escape route for the prophets. Man. The Lord about to come through big time for us. Always, man. man. Right. See? And he only gonna deliver those who got faith, man. Right. Some guys have been teaching, and he, he been you teaching in the name of your house, child, but you don't believe. Though. But you teach it right. contrary to his to, to his doctrine, but to you, his reputation. Come on, man. You going you 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 uh disrespecting his rep. You know, man, you gonna pay for that. Go ahead. You bearing false witness. Really, you bearing false witness against the most, uh, most high and his son. Go ahead. This is Isaiah <clears throat> chapter thirty-one, verse five. As birds flying, so will the Lord of hosts defend Jerusalem. Defending also, he will deliver it, and passing over it, and passing over, he will preserve it. Right, as birds flying, man. All right, and that's speaking of the chariots, what you ignorantly call UFOs. All right. UAPs, but they are identifiable to us as the vehicles of our salvation, okay? Right, and the vehicles of our of our power, you all by Shimmy Go ahead. That was it. All right, go up. ahead. This Isaiah 40 and 31, <laughs> but they that wait upon the Lord shall renew their strength. But they that wait upon the Lord shall renew their strength. See, we getting stronger in the spirit. We turning up in the spirit while these other camps getting weaker, man. Why? Because we believe, right? And we're watching and we're praying, right? And to the best of our ability, keeping, keeping his law, statutes, and commandments, man. That's what causes you to increase, man. All right? Lord say, if you will have faith as a mustard seed, all right, you will, you will uh, move mountains, man. <clears throat> they shall mount up with wings as eagles, and they shall run and not be weary, and they shall walk and not faint. Man, Jake be tired as hell, man. Yeah. Get off, of, get off of work. Then you go do, uh, the, the, you know, go do your studying, go do your lessons, whatever you gonna do. Man, like I, I supposed to work tonight, you know. I don't know how that's gonna work out, but Lord willing, I have no strength. Cause when, cause really the spirit just take over you, man. When you when you preaching the word, all right. And when you finish, it's like the spirit leave you. You like, <sighs> you know. But hey, at the end of the day, you you rather suffer for righteousness' sake. Right. You know, you rather uh, the Lord be using you, all right, to bring out this ministry. Than you being in the world and abusing it, all right? Neglecting the gift of faith. Can't see, you're in the dark. In the dark, man. <laughs> Not in the past, that's, that's the worst thing in the world is to, is to be in the dark on something important. Something you really need to know, you blind to. But damn, I don't, I don't. And, then, and then you got somebody telling you and you don't wanna listen. Yep. The Lord got your mind uh, 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 completely blocked off, shut off, to where you you just gotta stay in that in that box, engulfed in the world. <laughs> you you just gotta stay engulfed in in in, in, in that position you at until until He decide to take you out of it. <laughs> the only way you coming out is by death, man. Yep. Death by pain. Nigga, snap out of it. <laughs> Smite. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Poof. That's how the Lord coming, man. That's He gonna snap our people out of it and turn them into dust. Right. Poof. Right. Like we were reading in uh, what is that Exodus? They say he, he fell upon him. Lord gonna <laughs> send somebody <laughs> to <just> fall <laughs> upon you, niggas, man. Yeah, one, huh? This Isaiah twenty-one and nine. And behold, here coming a chariot of men with a couple of horsemen, and he answered and said, Babylon is falling, is falling, and all the graven image of her gods. He had broken unto the ground. He had broken their images unto the ground. What the Lord say, heaven and earth shall pass away, but my word shall not pass away. Right? Are we not in Babylon today? Babylon the great 
All right, the virgin daughter of Babylon. All right, the Lord is about to uh, smite this place, man. Okay. All right, come down and sit in the dust. That's right. <laughs> and everybody that wants to be uh, engulfed in this place, you're going to be turned into dust right with it. Man, yeah. no hand, join the hand. What's up? It right. said, on my threshing and the corn of my floor, that which I have heard of the Lord Yahweh of hosts, the power of Israel, I have declared unto you. Yeah, he's shown us the power, all right? Our power, the power of Yasharala, he's shown, all right? He's shown us, but he only shown it to who? The elect of the nation. Yeah. yeah. Not giving up to everyone to know the missions. Yep. That's why it's stumbling blocks. <laughs> yep. That's right. Go ahead, Karab. You this got is, something you know? Yeah, I got some. Y'all come back. This is uh, Matthew 13 and 14. And in them is fulfilled the prophecy of Isaiah, which said, By hearing, ye shall hear and shall not understand. Where you at? Matthew 13 and 14. This oh, is, Bible Kusha. Jump up to verse 9. All right, come on. This is Matthew 13 and verse 9. Who hath an ear to hear, let him hear. Mm. In other words, who got faith? Go ahead. Uh, I jump it down. All right, I keep reading down. This is uh, verse 10. And the disciples came and said unto him, Why speakest thou unto them in parables? Mm. He answered and said unto them, Because it is given unto you to know the mysteries of the kingdom of heaven, but to them it is not given. Yeah. For whosoever hath to him shall be given, and he shall have more abundance. Right, so when the, when the, when Yahweh Shai said uh, the kingdom of heaven is within you, <laughs> he really was speaking to the elect. Because the kingdom of heaven is not within the uh, average Negro, Latino, Native American men. Right. And it's definitely not in these the heathens, no. The only portion of the kingdom you're gonna have is slavery, mm -hmm. servitude, right. all right? That's your that's your portion. <laughs> Go ahead. Verse twelve. For whosoever have to him shall be given, and he shall have more abundance. But whoso have not, for him shall be taken away. So you're going to see the balance of power, right? Because if now it seems as if the lowly and the meek, all right, and those of the household of faith, all right, we have no power. Right. It seems that way, but the power is within us, right? ready to be unlocked all right it's like we going through that that time of training right you know where we building up until that day where the lord uh uh, uh increases us man right you know yep. to the day of uh to the day of our uh our power right <laughs> go ahead finish it you got it corrupt verse 13 therefore i speak out to them in parables because they see see not and hearing they hear not, neither do they understand. And in them is fulfilled the prophecy of Isaiah, which said, By hearing ye shall hear and shall not understand, and seeing ye shall see and shall not perceive. So it's like, you know, we uh somewhere in a room, all right, full of people, and everybody can hear us talking, but they don't know what we're talking about. Almost like we speak in a different language. But we speak in the same language, but we speak in the lingo that they can't they can't groove to. But the scriptures say we have piped unto them. Right. But they have not danced. You know? Yep. Like, you know, it's like we singing a song, we all know it. I'm like, man, well, I ain't never heard that song before. Yeah, we know you ain't never heard it before. <laughs> and then when they hear us singing it, they can't learn it. They don't like it. They all, they all, yeah. 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 Michael Blackston. <laughs> Can't get you Michael with this. Can't get you with this. Because in a way, we are speaking parables, you know. Because, you know, we say C19. We say other words. Right. So MOTB. You, the MOTB. So you two want to take the video down. And right. on the outside looking at you probably don't understand that, man. And they and they lose faith. And they just give up, you know. Karagma. We yeah, speak karagma. In, speaking in Greek. Speaking in Hebrew. You know, people don't know. A lot of people don't know what we be saying, man. They say with a stem in, uh, stem in your lips. And another tongue. So they speak. Yep. Yep. You got a, a 
Go ahead, Coco. This is 2 Thessalonians chapter 2, verse 10. And with all deceivingness, deceivableness and unrighteousness in them that perish, because they receive not the love of the truth, that they might be saved. For this cause, Yahweh Shem Avashai shall send them strong delusion. Right, man, strong delusion. America is a strong delusion, man. Right. right? America really is a dream. Like this whole life we live in here in America, this shit ain't nothing but a dream. <laughs> the, scriptures, the scriptures say it, it shall fly away as a dream. That's right. You know? And they their motto, <gasps> their motto, one of their sins is the American dream. Man. Go ahead, bro. That they should believe a lie, and that they all might be damned who believe not the truth, but had pleasure in unrighteousness. Who, who, who is say gonna do that? Who is say gonna do that? It said, for this cause, Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai shall send them strong delusion that they should believe a lie and that they all might be damned who believe not the truth mm. but had pleasure in unrighteousness. All right, so the Most High gonna, gonna put these people in the spiritual days. That's right. <laughs> they ain't gonna be able to see what's going on. Yeah. He gonna have them so focused on their own way of life that they gon' the that they gon' they, they gonna be too busy for the truth. He'll have them so focused on everything except for true life. You know? Like every way is the way except for the way. Yeah. Proving, proving, <laughs> proving the Lord. Alright, name. He is. Yep. He said that word, the blind leader of the blind, both should work. So the Hab Shah the one that gave them. The eyes that they can see and the ears they can't hear. That's right. All for what? They destruction. Yep. See, they don't say lie. Yep. See? Yeah, you see, you us brothers, we see miracles every day. Yep. Yeah, right, especially bro. when we driving. These people can't drive out here, man. Yeah, uh -huh. See, I almost got an accident. Got no 18 wheeler just jump in front of me. Went slow, goddamn, in the yeah. fast lane. How the hell you do that? You gotta stay in the slow, the slow lane, man. All right. That don't let it's other things too, man. That's what they call it, the valley shadow of death. Everything yep. here in the will lead to your yep. death. Yep. That's why the second answer, just the second chapter said, flee the shadow of this word, man. You know, cause this word is corrupt, it's wickedness. Everything lead to your death. You know, every little thing. That's why you got detached from this place and come back to Yahweh Shalom Shabbat, man. Hey, the scriptures say what is that in Colossians? The, the, all things were made by Yahweh Shai. Yeah, right. He made the heavens, the earth. He said, things, things that are seen, and matter of fact, Bible Shai. Yeah, right. He did. But you. Not seen. Right. Yeah. But he didn't, he didn't, he didn't, he didn't, he couldn't turn water into wine. He couldn't, he couldn't feed uh, uh, five, what was it, 5,000 with five loaves oh. and five fish. Come on, yeah. He couldn't do that. He, he made the whole earth that you walk on with. Uh, all this uh, water and ocean that Esau still hadn't discovered uh, even 5% of. <laughs> but he couldn't turn water into wine. Right. He, couldn't, he couldn't part the Red Sea. He made the sea. Exactly. The seas obey, obey him. him. Yeah, come on, man. That's how he was able to uh, walk <laughs> the water like that, man. <laughs> told, the, <laughs> told the sea to be still, right. be quiet. Uh, hey, the apostles were there. Ah, like, hey, what kind of man is this? To, guess, you know, uh, even the even the, uh, the, the 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 sea, the ocean, listen to him. Come on, man. Bring it, bring it out real quick, guys. All right, come on. This is uh, Mark six, and I started uh, verse forty nine. Uh, but when they saw him walking upon the sea, they supposed it had been a spirit. Read, 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 more power. All right, come on. This is Mark six and forty nine. But when they saw him. Walking upon the sea, they supposed it had been a spirit and cried out, for they all saw him and were troubled. And immediately he talked with them and said unto them, Be of good cheer, it is I, be not afraid. And when he went up, them into the ship, and the wind ceased, and they were so amazed in, in themselves beyond measures and wonder. For they consider not the miracle of the loaves, for their hearts were hard. 
and, and that's that, that's what's crazy. Like, it, it, even the disciples there, in real time, the things that Yahweh Shah was doing was seeming unbelievable. Even though they seen it, they was like, "Did this man just yeah. stop the waves from rowing?" Yes, he created them. Give me that in the Colossians, man. This is Colossians one and sixteen. <laughs> For by him were all things created. Started. Uh, 15. 15. 15. All right, come. This is Colossians 1 and 15. Who is the image of the invisible power, the firstborn of every creature? For by him were all things created that are in heaven. So, do you believe this? <laughs> do you? Hey, one body in your house shot. Do you believe Colossians 1 and 15? Is that true? <laughs> Nigga. Go ahead, man. For by him were all things created that are in heaven and that are in earth, visible and invisible, whether they be thrones or dominions or principalities. And my, and my answer to that is, if you don't, what are you here for? Right. What are you teaching? Why is your name one body in your house shot? Man, come on, bro. Or powers. All things were created by him and for him. So if all things were created by you and for you, can't you do whatever you want to do with those things? Right. It's yours. You is yours. <laughs> but that's saying witchcraft, though. But y'all the same people come back in your lot. Y'all call your house shot the devil back then, man. Yeah. Beelzebub. Yeah, Beelzebub, man. That's right. And now y'all saying Moses then split the Red Sea and all woo to woo. Y'all don't believe in miracles, man. It was worse and worse, man. Yep. It's about men don't do that, man. And it's only miraculous to us. It's nothing like it's for, for the like those are small things for your hard watching your house shot, man. Yep. You know? Hey, it's really, gonna kill you niggas too, man. Man, he gonna yeah. kill you niggas, man. I, I, I hope something happened to you niggas if you niggas don't repent, man. You niggas, you niggas, man. Like, change your name, nigga. Right. Please, change, change your name. That's, yeah, like, that's like, the most disrespectful like, thing yeah. ever. Like, <laughs> why do you even have your house shot on your name right. teaching the things that you teach, man? Hey, I, that made me think of uh, that movie with Denzel. I think it was, uh, was it uh, American Gangster? He told, he told us, hey man, put some, put another name on this shit. Don't call it that. Yeah, yeah. I don't give a fuck what you put on that. <laughs> call it blue dog yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Just don't call it that. That's copyright <laughs> infringement. Right. <laughs> change, change that name. Y'all need to get yeah, rid of uh, your house shot, man. Christ, put, Christ, put, Christ. Yeah, go and put Christ on there, man. First Baptist Church. Yeah. Come on, man. Stop bullshitting. One body and bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> go ahead, bro. Uh, that was it on the Colossians. All right. We can go. We, we, we can get what y'all got. And I, the last precept I got is John 20 and 29. Matter I'm of fact, matter of fact, get Acts 2 and 22. This is Acts 2, verse 22. Ye men of Israel, hear these words, Yahweh Shah of Nazareth, a man approved of Yahweh among you by miracles. Stop, and stop, 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 stop. Now, <laughs> where'd you find that? Bring it back. <laughs> Bring it back. <laughs> Bring it back and powerful, 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 man. This is Acts 22 and Acts 2 and 22. Ye men of Israel, Hear these words, Yahweh Shah of Nazareth, a man approved of Yahweh among you by miracles. By what? Ooh. By miracles. By what? By miracles and wonders and signs, mm. which Yahweh did by him in the midst of you, as ye yourselves also know. So how can you be one body in Yahweh Shah and you don't approve of the miracles that's written in the Bible that he done? Change your name, Change your name <laughs> Change nigga. Your name, man. Wrap it up. Change your name, man. Hey, I got to fuck this. <laughs> Put something else on it, man. <laughs> Just join IUIC, nigga. Change, 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 Change Go back. Change your name, man. Change your name. Hey, I got something. Go ahead. This is Luke 12 and 9. 
but he that denied me before men shall be denied before the angels in of Yahweh by Shema mm -hmm. yep. This John 11, 46. But some of them went their ways to the Pharisees and told them what things Yahweh had done. Then gathered the chief priests and the Pharisees a council and said, What do we? For this man doeth many miracles. <laughs> if we let him, <laughs> if we let him thus alone, who was doing the miracles, man? <laughs> yeah, how was shy? How was shy was doing the miracles? Yeah. All right, but here it is. If they were allowed, you how was shy continue, then they were gonna lose their spot. Yeah, they gonna lose their position. They gonna lose their uh, yeah, yeah, right. And that's what it is. These niggas want the glory. They don't want you how was shy to have the right. glory. They want to have. They want. They, they want. Wait. The, they want the glory. Right. They let Esau spin. They can't wait, man. Yeah. <laughs> See. Verse 48. If we let him thus alone, all men will believe on him. Right. And the woman should come and take away both our place and nation. You see that? <laughs> so maybe somebody's that got paid off. That's exactly. Right. Yeah. And one of them, named Caiaphas, being the high priest that same year, said unto them, Ye know nothing at all. Yeah, because you remember how Shah was the blind. In the sick, you know, doing, doing, doing uh, many miracles, man. Yep. It said, "No, consider that it is expedient for us that one man should die for the people, and that the whole nation perish not." Mm. And this speak he not of himself, but being high priest that year, he prophesied that Yahushua should die for that nation, Ooh. and not for that nation only. But that also he should gather together and won the children of the Most High that was scattered abroad. Right, meaning the northern kingdom. Exactly. Yeah. Right. It said, then from that day forth, they took counsel together to put... <laughs> and Salakia, so let me say this, because not just the northern kingdom, because you did have, even, even you had some of the southern kingdom that was scattered from that region at that time too, but the bulk of them were there. So, yeah. it, it, but majority of those that were scattered at that time was the northern kingdom man you got it back in john 11 53 this last one then from that day forth they took counsel counsel together for to put him to death right and that's what they doing to this day crucify i was shy coming up with these counsels after they read what's written in the scriptures and say oh they don't really mean that oh that was witchcraft what niggas what are you talking what are you about, talking about? You niggas, allegory. you niggas must got that stick, man. Y'all got that juice, man. Yeah, you, boy, you know, you know what's going on behind. Them, man. <laughs> they, 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 they got that. They, it's obvious. They got that stick, man. It's obvious, man. Right. Yeah, get the. Uh, did you copy John? Oh, I got. Y'all can know got John. Did somebody yeah. else have something before? This is, yeah. Yeah. Go ahead, go ahead, Tom. Y'all brought this up. Bring it up. This is uh, Second Timothy. Chapter 3, verse 1. This know also that in the last days yes. perilous times shall come. Beautiful. For men shall be lovers of, of their own selves, covetous, boasters, proud, blasphemers, disobedient to parents. Hey man, that's blasphemy. What you saying about the most high and his son. Right? Because if you saying it about the son, you saying it about the most high. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Go ahead unthankful unholy without natural affection truth breakers false accusers incontent fierce despiser of those that are of good traitors uh what the word is heady heady, 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 heady high-minded lovers of pleasures more than lovers of the most high having form of godly godliness uh, but, about this word yep no, that's what they loving, man. They loving the pleasure of this world, man. Huh? They comfortable. They comfortable in Babylon. What the Lord said, "Watch you there, what set upon their leave." Yep. Your leave, man. Yep. Having a form of godliness, but what? Having a form of godliness, but denying the powers thereof. Right. Mm. Right. <laughs> and when you prophesy with your head covered, you denying the power. Come right. on, man. Right. <laughs> and I don't mean to get graphic, but. What's the purpose of you 
you get circumcised, right? That's a token. But when you get circumcised, basically, what are you doing? You're uncovering your head, nigga. <laughs> Dumbass, man. Too proud, though. Dumb, and that's so simple, man. Even, even in these fucking Christian churches, they take their hats off when they come into the service, man. Oh, and I back was... in the day, the uh, women used to wear right. the hats in the, in the, in the, in the, in, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. ah. Some big ass hats. Ah. <laughs> One thing about it, that nigga gonna take the head off. Cause when you got, when you go to court, <laughs> You, you can't, gotta, you can't, you can't walk can't in the courtroom with a hat on. You gotta take it off so how much more in the presence of your high yeah, about Shemar man. The true counsel, the true, where well, you supposed to be a true judge. When last time you seen a judge in a courtroom with a fucking hat on, man? Come on, man. You supposed, when you go into the word judge, man, exactly. what does it mean, man? An administrative head of Israel. Judges were set up by Israel, nigga. When the last time you went in a courthouse and you saw a judge with a hat on? Or a nigga in the courtroom with, with a hat on. on. <laughs> Having a form of godliness, but never able to come to the truth, man. Yeah. Right. Yeah. You sit here, I got no respect for the Lord. Hey, man. the days no honor. Come, brother. No honor. Them days, and the Lord about to cut it short, man. The Lord about to come down, man. And, and he, you gonna put some respect on his name. And you gonna put some respect on his word. That's right. Because right. he said what? He put his word above thy name. Go ahead, bro. Yeah, yeah, All right. Yeah. All right, this is John 20 and verse 29. It says, Yahweh said unto him, Thomas, because thou hast seen me, thou hast believed. Blessed are they that have not seen and yet have believed. That's it, man. That's, that's it. You know? And, and, and Lord willing, we endure and we stay strong. Keep pushing. All right? Keep the faith. Keep believing. Keep foolproofing the ministry, man. Because the Lord is going to continue to work miracles, all right, on the earth. And he's going to work miracles through us, man. Right. And when you see it, all right, <laughs> all you unbelievers know, <laughs> the Lord say, uh, a sinful, uh, a wicked generation yeah, seeking yeah. for a sign, but they shall receive none. Sign, sign of the, of the prophets. prophets. Yeah. Sign of the prophets, man. So this was your time. That's right. This is your time to repent and get right, you know. On every level, man, it's time to uh, turn up right. in the spirit. Okay. You got it, Navarre. All right, so with that, I hope your brothers and sisters were edified. You know, so once again, we're going to turn to the east. We give our honor, glory, and power to Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh, Bashem, 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 Bashem. I say double honor to our elders and peace of best of the hope you let. Next time, Shalom. 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 Baba Baba. Baraka Akim, baby. Baraka Akim. 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 Ba